I've got some leftover dressing and I'm gonna take this leftover dressing and make a dressing waffle out of it and then pour some gravy on top of it and it's gonna be so good. So in my bowl, I have two cups of leftover dressing. You're gonna want one egg per two cups of leftover dressing, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and crack me an egg in there. I'm gonna mix this around, get that stuffing coated with it. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of chicken broth to that. Uh, about a quarter cup we're gonna start off with and see what that looks like. And you'll want to kind of mash that dressing up as you mix it together. So I ended up adding about a half a cup of the chicken broth to get the texture that I wanted for the waffle machine or my waffle maker. And how much you add all depends on how your dressing is made, honestly. So start off at a quarter cup per two cups of leftover dressing and one egg and then add more broth accordingly as you need. Now I've already sprayed this with nonstick cooking spray. And I am just going to you hear that sizzle? I'm going to turn this down a little bit and spread that over just like so. And I'm going to, and now I'm going to flip it over and do one over here. I'm going to spread this around. And I'll come back once it's done. Look at that, you guys. Yum. All right, let's see if we can get this out. Woo. Look at that. And this one is a little bit smaller. I didn't quite fill out the waffle pan. Look at that, a dressing waffle. Now we gotta get some gravy and pour it in all the crevices. I've got some homemade turkey gravy here. Chicken gravy would be delicious too. And I am just gonna pour it all over that waffle, let it get in all those little crevices. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is gonna be so good. All right. It's hot, but let me get a let me get a little bite, a little a little taste test, if you will. Mmm, 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 man, that is out of this world, y'all. Let me get me a little bit more gravy. Y'all have got to make this. And if you don't have any leftover dressing, then you just need to make some fresh dressing so you can make this. Mmm, man. If you want to get the printable or screenshotable recipe, then head over to my website, my food blog, mrshappyhomemaker.com. I'm gonna finish eating this. Mm -hmm.